Encountering the error performing in page operation in Windows 11? Here are five fixes to resolve this issue quickly. A practical solution would be using a professional PC repair tool designed for Windows OS issues that automatically scans your device and repairs faulty files. Registry settings also play a crucial role in your system's health and stability. Therefore, monitoring these elements and addressing them when they are in critical condition is essential. Press the Windows key on your keyboard, type System Restore, and click on Create a Restore Point option. In the System Properties window, click the System Restore button. Click Next when the System Restore window appears. Check the Show More Restore Points box if available. This will list all the available restore points. Select the most recent restore point and click Next. Read the description and click the Finish button. The restoring process may take a few minutes to complete depending on the restore point size. Press Windows key plus X and choose Windows PowerShell, Admin, from the menu. In the PowerShell window, type the following command and run it. CHKDSK per FC. The check disk utility will scan the hard disk for common errors and apply available fixes. After the scanning is finished, restart the computer. Now try to install or uninstall the program that was triggering the error performing in-page operation error and check for any improvements. Press Windows key plus I. Go to System. From the left pane, click on the Recovery tab. Then, under the Reset This PC section, click the Get Started button. In the Choose an Option window, you will be presented with two options. Keep my files. This option will remove apps and settings, but keeps your files. Remove everything. This option will remove your files, apps and settings. We recommend you select the Keep My Files option first. This will reset the Windows OS while preserving the personal files. However, if the issue persists, perform a complete reset using the Remove Everything option. Once done, check for for any improvements. Right-click on the Start button and select Device Manager from the list. Click on the Universal Serial Bus Controller section to expand it, right-click on a driver, and select Update Driver. Now you can select Search automatically for drivers, or if you already have one, pick the second option. If the system finds a new driver, it will install it. If not, that means the best one is already installed. However, you can click on Search for Updated Driver on Windows Update. In the next window, click on the Check for Updates button. Install any new update especially the optional driver update. Thanks for watching. If it helps, make sure to hit like and subscribe.